got Keith Urban here. Oh, Prolific. He's been making great music for many years. He's been a huge influence on us since the very beginning of our career. He has so much experience. He's been on The Voice. He's a walking Wikipedia for music. Great to look at, too. <laughs> He's obviously a legend. He's won so many awards, collaborated with so many people. Keith! Another day at the office, John. I love that you have your guitar here. Well, that's what I do. Ready to jam. You never know. Good to see you, sir. Good to see you, too. I'm learning from him, too. He's really giving great notes for every artist. I can feel a bit of nerves. I felt like I was hearing your voice more than feeling you. And you got it. It's that yeah. look. <laughs> it's that swag. Yes. He's giving really great notes about how he prepares himself, but also great musical advice on just the right things to do in the right moments. The dichotomy about being a performer on stage is being completely present and completely lost in the moments. Mm -hmm. I'd always go to the story, the story, the story. Mm -hmm. A place, a color, a person, smells. I, I can see it in my head as I'm singing it, so it's very real to me. I knew his team would be stealth singers, and they are. And it's great listening to him give feedback as well. Wow. I wonder if we should slow it down a hair. Mm. I just want to luxuriate in your voice a little bit more. Oh, thank you. Yeah. But I think it'll just let you air Except it out a little space. bit. Yeah. They say now that we're together, we're urban legend. Apparently. That's Apparently. What they say. Apparently. Urban legend. The new duo, the new album coming out soon. <laughs> Reba. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. How you doing, Ashley? I love having Keith Urban here because he is a genius in music. Lose yourself in it. Yes, sir. Take ownership of it. Okay. You got the pipes to support you, so why not? He is a walking or a sitting down Wikipedia of all music. And you got some Travis Tritt in there. Man, that ain't the first time I've it's heard really that. really good. That song particularly, it's written very rhythmically, so everything is kind of in this rhythm. Like if you sang even a bit behind the beat occasionally, just a little bit of, just occasionally. Okay. Then you'll take ownership of it, it'll keep my attention. You are, you know more I about know country songs. music. Yeah. Than most people in the business. I don't know about that, but I do know a lot of songs. You do. As do you. When you come up playing in the clubs, Yeah. you have to know a lot of songs. Cover tunes? Yep, tons of them. Tons of them. You guys get little to no sleep during this period. I didn't get a lot of sleep. I was thinking about today. When your voice is not quite there for you because you're tired, forget that high note and find the lower note that you, you could hit that lyric right there and maybe one note up there. Okay. Make the lyric be the thing. My voice is not there. All right, I'm going to tell a story even more. Good note. I want to use that. <laughs> I might use it myself. <laughs> <laughs> Write that down. <laughs> I love Reva. I love her. I love you. She's everything you'd want. Pro, super chill, like all the balances that you want. Being completely on, completely loose, pro, relaxed. Thank you. All that balance is Aww. what you got going on, Reva. Thank you. Yeah. Did y'all get that on tape? We got that. Thank we you. Got that. I love you too, Mom Reva. <laughs> Keith, I'm so happy to have you on the show, man. Thanks, Chance. It's gonna be legendary. What up, y'all? We got the band here. Oh, yeah. They've been working hard, man. I've been having them change keys and tempos. Yeah. And no, that's grilling perfect. them on everything. It's been great. It's so cool to have Keith here. <laughs> he doesn't he doesn't want me to talk him up, but obviously a legend, and he's been giving the greatest advice to my team. So it's a blessing to have you, man, for real. That song is so suited to you. The only thing is, I would rein it in just a little bit. Like when you start the song, you could be even a little more tender. The ownership you had at the end of the song after you hit that high note, and then you just let it sit for as long as you wanted before you came back in, right? The whole band's waiting on you. <laughs> Have that ownership from the very beginning to the end. Stay. Whatever you do mm. there yeah. is so much better. Dang, you just hit that note so easily. <laughs> He's got a good team. Oh, man, you. got really you. good advice, too, man. You guys are both huge inspirations, so. Oh, thanks, man. Thank you. It's really good, especially how to work cameras and performance things, yeah. really cool. When you were asking about working the stage, decide exactly where your focus is gonna be, if it's gonna be on me on the day of or a specific side of the crowd, and that'll kind of help map out your movements. It's a great song choice, but because it matches your tone, it's almost like it's too Miley. Right. I'm waiting to discover who you are. Yeah, that's a big part of it too. It's yeah. the voice, but it's also the step, you know? Yes. So yeah. they gotta have that step to them. I don't know if you have this, but you give advice to someone and you're driving home and you're like, I should probably do that myself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I learned so much just being on this show. Yeah, for sure.
How are Look you, at this man? guy. Look at you guys. How are you, brother? How are you, Dan? So good to see you, Kate. Thinking back, it feels like yesterday when we first met you, and you came up and said the kindest things to us. This was right after we put out our first single. Mm -hmm. Yep. And you said you loved the song 19, You and Me, and I yeah. was like, I carried that with me the rest of our career, man. That meant a lot. Well, you guys are great writers, and that was where Scott Hendricks called me, and he goes, man, you got to hear these guys' songs. That's, That's awesome. awesome. And over the years, Keith, you've been so gracious to us. Likewise. And we really do. We listen to his advice. Anything that he'll ever give us, it's very high praise, and it's always fantastic advice. I feel like you're going to have so much great stuff to say. We have great stuff to say it. because we have Keith Urban here. Oh, please. We actually have him here today is an unbelievable honor for us and really cool for everybody. To have him here as a mentor. Killing it for us. Absolutely the crushing best it for us. At one moment you were sort of a little unsteady and you closed your eyes and I could feel you center into the song. It was great. If you start to feel a little nervous, just see if you can center yourself again and lose yourself in the song and you literally will draw us in. Fantastic job. I gotta give it to Keith Urban right here for giving you some of the greatest coaching and advice. I know. Yeah, give it up. Thank you guys. These guys have the most eclectic array of artists, which is so <laughs> cool. All great singers, but all so unique. And I love these days, you know, I love being able to be in a situation where you can really help the artists. And, you know, I hear these guys' advice and I always learn something as well. So it's a it's a win-win. Being able to mentor these contestants is incredible. You've really done that for us over the years, which we're very grateful for. These people all look up to you, man. And uh, that means a lot. The words that you give them, I feel like they're going to carry with them the rest of their lives. So. Awesome. Uh, love you, brother. Love you too, Dan. I had such a great time mentoring this go around. The coaches have some amazing teams. Uh, it was a lot of hard work, but a lot of great work. I think the performances are going to be spectacular. Uh, fingers across for all of them. Let's check it out.